Minnesota Vikings center Garrett Bradbury is truly rising up and is playing some of the best football in his NFL career. And ever since the Vikings drafted him in 2019, we thought he was our savior at center. He didn't play the best in 20, since 2019, and although after 2021, um, he's a great leader, great, great at communicating to his fellow offensive linemen, great out in space, great out in the perimeter, great, great blocker on screens, for example, screens to Alexander Madison, uh, Donald Cook, etc. But when it came to those one-on-one -on -one spots, op opposing teams' defensive coordinators could figure Bradbury out right with a, with, a, with a flick of the wrist or with a snap of the finger, whatever you want to call it. And then, boom, the big, 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 like 340, 330-pound defensive defensive tackles would have Garrett Bradbury right in, right in, the, right in, push right into Kirk Cousins' lap, ruining plays, ruining drives, ending drives. Forcing the punt team to come out there, it wasn't good. It was just not good. But now, general manager Quasi Duffelmenta, head coach Kevin O'Connell, offensive coordinator Wes Phillips, and offensive line coach Chris Cooper, they all believe that they can change him, and I think they have changed him. Because so far, Garrett Bradbury is playing the best football of his career um, ever since the season started, the 2022 season, and Garrett Bradbury has been holding things down for quarterback Kirk Cousins. And also, even Christian Derrissaw has been playing well as well. So, Chris, uh, Garrett Bradbury, he's looking a lot better. He's looking a lot better, and he added he added weight by eating, of course, and then and then uh, working it out. We all remember the beef and ice cream. Yeah, we remember all that, of course. But I think it's safe to say that Bradbury has become a better center. I think he's fixed, and it's all thanks to the Vikings staff. I think that Bradbury, even though they declined his fifth year option. He's gonna. He's going places. He's definitely going places. And with the Minnesota Vikings, he's doing very well. He's doing very well. But that leaves you with a question: like, who are the Vikings going to pick up at center after Garrett Bradbury's gone? I wonder about that. But so far, Bradbury's doing well. Very, very happy to see that. Something that you love to see, especially as a guy who roots for Garrett Bradbury, because you love him a lot. I, I, I love, I love him a lot. And the Vikings' offensive line and pass protection in general. I don't think it's fixed, fixed yet, but it's getting close. But with and, and with Garrett Bradbury out there, Garrett Bradbury himself is definitely fixed, and he's got good talent. So he's gonna continue to showcase that talent. I'm very glad to see that he's holding up now on one-on-one -on -one spots. Of course, we saw that at first. We saw in training camp when he got power slammed by Harrison Phillips. We thought that Garrett Bradbury was just like not that dude anymore. We're like, okay, well, we should give up on this guy. Oh, all that all that effort to try and fix him, but nope. But about the same time, Harrison Phillips is an amazing dude. He is, when you see a bad dude like that running after you, I mean, his nickname is Harry the Horrible, or Horrible Harry, because of how just elite he is, and how he scares other teams' offenses. So, other than that, Garrett Bradbury, amazing player. He's got no issues now, thank God. And... Because of Bradbury, we were also wondering in the 2022 draft that should we have drafted Tyler Linderbaum? His only he 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 is a, he's an amazing center. His only issue is he's undersized, 290 pounds. But he's on, he's on the Ravens now and probably will not go to the Vikings. But for Garrett Bradbury, I mean you can you see three 330 pound centers getting getting uh, thrown around sometimes as well. But Garrett Bradbury, proud to see, proud to see him uh, at the at the talent level that he's that he's at right now. Hopefully he, he he takes that talent, keeps on going and holding things up for Kirk Cousins, for Kirk Cousins to up uh, uh uncork deep balls to Justin Jefferson, Adam Thielen, KJ Osborne scoring touchdowns, keeping drives alive, and go down and make make, make the playoffs and even win the Super Bowl. Who knows? Who knows? But Garrett Bradbury, your thoughts on our thoughts. Garrett Bradbury is becoming a better center. I think he already is a better center. Thank you so much for watching. Let us know your comments in the in this comment section down below. Please subscribe and scroll Vikings.